Hey, hey, how's it going? Hey, hey. What's, what's, what does this mean to Cleveland, really? You've been here in Cleveland since the 70s. It means we're getting what we deserve, and it's about time. <laughs> Yeah, you know, we're the rock and roll capital of the world, and uh, it's time for us to reclaim it. Exactly. So you like it here every three years? You like that? Vibe? I yeah, I think it works. I think it works best because yeah. New York is a 24-hour city. It would be difficult to do it year after year. It would end up costing more than the money that Cleveland gets. So it's better to do this once every three years, and then we can really roll out the red carpet and do it right. Who are you looking forward to tonight? Uh, a little bit of everything. I'm I'm just looking forward to a good time. Right. That's what rock and roll is all about. Uh, it, you know, I, it, it, it really doesn't mean uh, anything to me other than the fact that I just want to see rock and roll kept alive and well in this town. Okay. We'll All right. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Welcome. See, you know I don't shake. Boom. Welcome to the red carpet, <laughs> Thomas, huh? Thank you. Are you this excited? I am. Isn't everybody? Yeah. I'm thrilled. Who are you looking forward to? I'm honored. Well, uh, I love Peter Wolf. Yeah. And we go way back, okay, although right. I don't know if either of us remember exactly <laughs> when and where. But yeah, Boston, yeah, yeah. 80s, nice. yeah. And I love Paul Butterfield, and I love Stevie Ray Vaughan, yeah. and you know, uh, I like them all. I like the Five Royales because I do go that far back. Yeah. <laughs> well, good to see you. How about you? Nice. Who do you want? Uh, You're a rock and roller. Are you really? And I like them too. Uh, American Idiot, you know. How can you not? 